What is up guys? We made it to Nevada. We are at the Valley of Fire in Nevada. Holy mackerel is this pace beautiful never seen something like it we have already seen a ram as we are coming into the place can't wait to see some bears or mountain lions um for our stay we are staying here tonight and tomorrow night and then we're gonna head to zion national park in utah let's see it is amazing it was so much better whenever the sun was hitting it but we had to get parked in our campsite this is our campsite for tonight we have a very nice fire pit we have a grill and we have a canopy that we can stay under um, it's ten dollars to get into the park and then ten dollars for your campsite they have showers and bathrooms and everything that you need for camping <coughs> there's Ashley Ashley say hello Hi. there you go um, so that's it for the night what is up guys it is the morning time and we got some breakfast cooking. Got some mac and cheese going, and already finished the rice right there. Oh man, Ashley already had her breakfast, and this is mine. We also have a clothesline to dry our clothes. We went to that laundry mat, but some of our stuff can't be dried, so we just hung up a clothesline. De definitely recommend bringing some extra um, rope, because you never know what you could use it for. They're staring. They're staring at us. They're letting us get really close. What if they run after us? This is probably a really stupid idea.
not throw that at me. <laughs> no, it's gonna hurt! I'm freezing! <laughs> What is up guys? Good afternoon. It is one o'clock where we are. Four o'clock in Florida. Um, we are out here on BLM land. It is probably about 35, 40 degrees. We have a beautiful fire going. Um, and we also have our clothes drying right up here. The reason we have our clothes drying up here is the hotel we stayed at, Highland Estates. Uh, the dryer wasn't working and it didn't dry our clothes properly. So we have them just all sprawled out with the natural sunlight. Clothes won't shrink anyways. It's free to do it this way. So there's no, no problem doing it like this. We do have a fire going right on the other side of our clothes. Let me show you that. There's beautiful Ashley. My freaking shadow is blocking it, huh? Woo! Parkour! Anyways, really nice fire. Also, again, like I said, we're staying on BLM land. Um, there's no one out here patrolling, so you do have to stay out here on your own risk. But if you're looking to save money, this is the way to go. Instead of paying $35 a night at a national park or state park, stay out here on BLM land. You can find the spots online um, where to stay. But again, stay out here at your own risk. We haven't had any problems for the three nights that we've been out here. But again, you never know. You don't know who's coming through this road, who's staying out here, who could do anything. But we, again, we haven't had anything happen to us. Been out here for three nights. There's other campers around, but do just gotta warn you, it is at your own risk. Hello guys. We are at a place called Horseshoe Bend in Arizona. This is definitely a place that I recommend visiting. Um, there is a lot of people here, but holy mackerel. Look at that view. The camera obviously doesn't do it justice. This is thousands of feet up. And that is Lake Powell down there. You can kayak, you can jet ski, you can boat all around there again this lake is called lake powell and this is horseshoe bend type that in your gps and it'll bring you right here it does cost ten dollars to get in uh, and they do allow dogs